Hey everyone, so today, super excited about this video. Uh, we're actually gonna be talking about how I made this face wash. It, in the video, it is a smaller container, yes, because this face wash I made about a week or two ago and I just wanted to try it on my own skin to see how I liked it and see if it irritated my skin in any way. It is pH balanced, it has a pH balance of about a 6.5, so, that's fine because our skin's pH is about a 5.5 anyway. So anyways, if you are interested in learning how I made this face wash using simple ingredients, uh, please watch the rest of the video. If you have any questions, uh, like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Instagram. My skin is pure. Same for YouTube. Uh, but yeah, enjoy the video, you guys. So first things first, you want to get your base, which is going to be a form of water. I used aloe water. You can also use uh, rose water or green tea or some regular water base. Uh, next is going to be glycerin. We're going to add this to our water phase as a humectant. Um, it's going to be about 1.2 teaspoon. Uh, don't mind her, y'all. <laughs> After adding your glycerin, you're going to get a separate jar so you can start adding your oil. Make sure it's a moisturizing oil. I personally wanted to use two. I'm going to add the benefits right next to this video so you guys can see why I chose them. For this next step, I decided to use one egg white. Uh, in order to replace the soy lecithin that you can also use. Um, you, If you do want to use the soy lecithin, only use 2%, which would be about uh, half of a teaspoon. Don't forget to add the lid or a piece of foil so nothing can fall in or out of the jars. Um, also, do not add the egg white to this phase in the oil phase, but if you have lecithin, add it to the oil jar. Make sure you add the water phase into the oil phase so you don't lose out on any of the oil that you choose to use. Next, you're gonna use one tablespoon of xanthan gum. Just use one for now and then wait it out. Uh, make sure you don't use too much apple cider vinegar. A, because it doesn't smell the best. Throwing it out there. Uh, B, because it is pretty acidic. It has a pH level of about two to three. Um, but without the apple cider vinegar, the face wash will be a little bit too basic. So, uh, if you have unscented cast out soap, that'd probably be a lot better or just the original cast out soap. Um, this almond oil cast out soap is not that harsh. So I feel like it worked for me. Um, the lavender or the rose one will probably be cool too, but. I just want to highlight how I did not let the soap settle or the bubble settle inside of the soap. And that was an issue for me because it looks like I have leftovers, but I really don't. Some of the bubbles kind of settled and went away, which made less of the product, which means I lost some product in that jar. So just wait. Let me address the elephant in the room, y'all. This video is not about my hair, okay? So don't judge me. This was day four hairstyle, whatever. Y'all feel me, okay? 
not about that. It's about faces. Mom told me life's not fair, so she advice right now.